Hello everyone, you guys asked a lot of queries on how I prepared for my Facebook system design interviews and since it's almost impossible to reply each and every one of you, so I thought of creating a structured playlist which will help you understand the basics of the system design and the core principles. And once we are done with the basics, we will try to build a couple of systems from the scratch. And hopefully by the end of this playlist, you will be able to come up with the solution for any system design related problem. So let's jump into the roadmap discussion. So let's discuss what we will be covering in this playlist. How do you build your distributed systems? What is monolithic architecture? What is service oriented architecture? What is microservices architecture? How do you build these very complex systems using some smaller components? What are these components? We will also learn how do you identify these smaller components? And once we identify these smaller components, we will also discuss how do you provide the trade-offs or how do you discuss the trade-offs when you are picking any external system to solve your use case. We will also discuss what are the prerequisites to build any systems. So we will discuss what is scalability, reliability, fault tolerance, replication, load balancing. What are the problems that these load balancers are trying to solve? types of load balancers and then we will discuss the pros and cons of the load balancer types and then we will discuss what is caching what is cache invalidation what are the cache eviction policies we will also discuss what is data sharding and how do you shard your data across different nodes in distributed systems we will also discuss the challenges sharding brings into your system like enforcing the constraints normalization joins rebalancing and then we will also discuss the indexing, what is indexing, what is indexing in case of SQL, what is indexing in case of no SQL, what is the challenge, what problem indexing is trying to solve and then we will discuss what are the proxy servers, what problems proxy servers are trying to solve and we will discuss reverse proxies. Then we will discuss the importance of replication and redundancy and we will also discuss how do you build fault tolerant systems and then we will discuss very hot topic which is SQL versus NoSQL the difference between the SQL and NoSQL databases we will also discuss how SQL stores the data in the database what is the schema what are the asset properties and how do you scale your SQL databases we will also discuss the cap theorem this is very 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 important then we will discuss what is consistent hashing what problem consistent hashing is trying to solve then we will also discuss the http long polling what are server sent events and what are web sockets and what is api how do companies build their systems using apis then we will also discuss some of the patterns in microservices architecture what is saga pattern what is cqrs what is strangler and saga is really important when you have to make sure that the transaction goes through across the different distributed systems so how do you achieve this pattern then we will also discuss the type of storage like block storage file storage object we will also discuss what are the message queues like kafka revit mq active mq and then we will also discuss what are the gossip protocols used by these message queues we will also discuss some rate limiting concepts so in this playlist we will discuss a lot of things which will help you understand the basics of the system design and once we are done with the basics we will also discuss what framework you should follow when you are solving the system design problem in your interviews like gathering the requirements high level apis data models high level design focusing on one or two components then discussing the single point of failures and the bottlenecks so once we are done with the basics and we have discussed what framework we should follow to solve a problem then we will go ahead and actually solve a problem we will try to build a system similar to uber rapido ola we will also build amazon like system and this will help you understand how do you actually take a problem in your system design interviews and then try to build the solution from scratch so hopefully by the end of this playlist you will be able to come up with a solution for any system design related problem that's it for this video see you in the next video